Hey guys, welcome back to Book by Brick, and today I'll be doing a set review on Lego Ninjago Raid Zeppelin. So let's start out with the minifigures. First up we have Dabloon, and he looks really cool. Uh, he's got two sword, jagged swords with a little skull print on them. And then he's got some sort of samurai helmet. And he's got a double-sided face. He also has these things. I'm not sure what they're called. And then here's his chest. And then it looks like he's got sword holders on the back. And then... He's got one orange leg and one brown leg. Okay, next up is Clancy. And I can't find his weapons. So, show them to you off the box. There. He's got that broom with a bucket. And the room has, has a spike on the end. But here he is, and here's his head. It's one of the snake heads from the uh, Anaconda season of Nidrago. Then more of these shoulder things. Then here's his shirt. He has one orange arm, one green one. And he's a snake, so... The orange is probably just some armor. Yeah, that's what it looks like. And then he has a stub leg. So, yeah. Then, last but not least, we have Zane. And here, this is a J in the Jin Sword. Uh, see, it comes with a little tile. Then the blade, and it's got a little skull piece there. And yeah. And then here's Zane. So he has the hood from the last season. And the same face from the, as the last season. But all the ninja have new shoulder pads. And this shoulder pad, in my opinion, is the coolest. It has one shoulder, and then both the swords go on one side. Looks really cool. And then here's his chest. And these are their jitsu suits because that's what they're called in the new season. So it has his little air jitsu symbol. Then there's a different one there. And then they have the same legs from the last season. So all their pieces are the same, except for their shirt and their shoulder pads. Except for some of them have, like, special faces in this season. Okay, next up is Zane's mini hovercraft. So he rides on it like this. There's a little handlebar for him to grab onto. And then he stands there. And it's not very sturdy. I don't really like it. I mean, it's cool, but eh, it just doesn't, it just doesn't work. <laughs> okay, and then it can shoot studs. I'll try to shoot this one at the camera. Okay. And yeah. Then here is the Raid Zeppelin. So here is the cannon. So you can in the top, you can take one of these, take it in the cannon, and then 
pull this back. Let's see if I can get an angle. So it doesn't shoot too far, but it shoots. And then it has these on the side that shoot studs. It's got a little wing. And here's the flag on the back. And I'll show you what the, this does in a second. And then there's Pirate Sword here. And another wing. And then there's the steering wheel. And back here are all the computers. So that's cool. And then the cannon's like on some sort of skull thing. But if you look at the bottom of this, it looks like a boat. But, and then it has this huge balloon up here. Nothing in the center. And then there's a frame coming out the back. See there's, and then there's a little roof covering the computers in case it rains, I guess. And then you can lift these wings up if you want. And then this is the last thing. So if you put something here, this comes with dynamite, but uh, you can't find it. But if you put something in this slot right here, and then when you pick it up, if you pull this little nub on the back, it'll come falling down. So I'm going to do that from a little bit lower so you can see it. There you go. So basically you just pull this out and the floor beneath where you put it just opens up. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today guys. Hope you liked the video. If you did, be sure to check out my other videos and leave a like and subscribe. See you next time. Bricks out.